We're bringing Shaq back to LA, but as a one-year-old. And every time we complete a challenge, he gets older. So we begin with a one-year-old Shaq that's one foot and 10 pounds, and he's a 40 overall. My first challenge is to beat this kid LeBron in a 1v1 matchup. All right, here we go. We got baby Shaq versus kid LeBron. First to five wins the game. It's twos and threes, so see if we can hit our first two-point shot right here. I'm gonna try to post it up, LeBron. Let me come around, and uh, we lost the ball, guys. Please don't make that three, and he misses. Get the rebound. I can't even grab the rebound, and just like that, we're down two to zero. And I I'm, I'm trying to, like, not lose the ball, but I we're literally not moving anywhere, so let me go for that spin right here. Go for another spin, and it hit LeBron's ankles. Uh, so I'm pretty sure it's our ball, and yeah, it's our ball. So here we go. We got 21 seconds on the clock. We got to make a shot right now, guys. We got to go quick. 18 seconds. This is it. This is to tie the game. Come on, right here. Oh. Oh, right here. Great pump fake. And yes, tie game. Let's go. What a shot from Shaq. Just look how tidy he is. <laughs> All right, so it's a tie game. We have to make a stop. And LeBron goes for the three. He misses. Come on. Please go out of bounce. Please. No. He's going for another three-point shot. Oh. Give me the rebound. I can't even grab her. Okay, there you go. There you go. Come on. Two to two. We can take the lead right here. And okay, okay. Hold on a second. Right here. And yes. And after scoring that shot, LeBron went up for another three, but missed. This is my chance to win the game. Four to two. We can go ahead and put this game away right here with Shaq. And let me go for like a spin move. Can you even go for a spin move? I don't know what that was, but I'll take it. So as promised, Shaq does get older. He's now seven years old and he gets upgraded to a 60 overall. My next challenge for this seven-year-old Shaq is to get three dunks against one of the greatest duos in NBA history. All right, here we go. We got seven-year-old Shaq and he can't really dribble, but yo, look at Kobe giving screens and Shaq with the, what? Oh, we almost dunked that. Wait, I thought that was a block and I don't know what just happened there. I think he almost got up and just lost control of the ball and Shaq just gets bullied by michael jordan right there bro this is this is gonna be tough it was really hard to get past scotty pippen and michael jordan because they're elite defenders come on kobe i need a solid screen let's try it again right here and shaq with the okay that's that's not a dunk bro and after struggling so much to get to the paint with shaq finally i got my first dunk come on shaq can i get the dunk 11 seconds i might have to go for a poster i might have to go for a poster though hey okay Yo, Shaq with a crazy duck. I did not expect that time was running out. But right after that, Michael Jordan answered right back with his two-pointer to take the lead. 13 seconds. Come on, we got to get a dunk. Come on. 10 seconds. We're running out of time. 8 seconds. Come on. Let me get that dunk though right here. And we got another one. Let's go. As soon as time was expiring once again, Shaq comes up with a clutch dunk right there. And with the game tied 4-4, four to four, I had to make one final stop to win the game. Oh, no, no. Please don't make it. Please don't make it. Oh, he missed. Yes. Let's go. Come on, man. We can win the game right here and get our final dunk. You know what? I'm going to try something different. I'm going to see if we can actually do an alley-oop to Shaq. I don't know if it's possible. I've never tried this. But, yo, here we go. And yeah, I don't think it's possible. Let's try it again. Maybe it's possible. I don't know. Maybe it is. Let's see here. Is it possible? And oh, it is. Let's go. We won the game. We got to see that one more time. Just take a look at that hate time from Shaq. And with that challenge complete, Shaq is now 20 years old and he's now at 80 overall. We're bringing Shaq back to Orlando. And my next challenge is to get three hook shots against the 94-95 New York Knicks. And I think I forgot how to do hook shots. And oh, there it is. Yes, okay. All right, I'll take it first attempt. But I got lucky with that first hook shot because I struggled to knock down my second. And that's a hook shot. And oh, we almost made it. Come on, Shaq, right here. Post him up. This barbecue chicken, baby, right here. Barbecue chicken. That's a hook shot. Hit it. Oh, what? Let me get this hook shot right here. Come on. This, this is it. This has got to be the one. Second one right here. Okay, that's like a fadeaway shot, and he actually made it. But before we continue with today's video, I'd like to give a quick shout out to our sponsor, DraftKings. After a long summer wait, the time has finally come for our favorite NBA teams to hit the court. And I've got some exciting news for you. We've teamed up with DraftKings Sportsbook to bring you a fantastic offer. All new customers who bet $5 will get $200 in bonus bets instantly. Download the DraftKings app and sign up using my promo code OKODRE. With your $200 in bonus bets, you can dive into the action by trying DraftKings Same Game Parlays. 
combine multiple bets from the same game, including player points, rebounds, assists, and more for a chance at a bigger payout. And if you already signed up with DraftKings, no problem. All customers can get a no sweat same game parlay or SGPX if your bet doesn't hit. Max reward limits apply. New customers use promo code OKODRE and bet just $5 on any wager and get $200 instantly. That's promo code OKODRE only at DraftKings Sportsbook. So why wait? Download the DraftKings app now. And thank you again to DraftKings for sponsoring today's video. And after so many failed attempts to knock down my second hook shot, I finally got this one to go in. We only got one hook shot. We got to get another one right here. Come on, bro. Why is this so hard to get these hook shots? I'm actually struggling to get a hook shot right here with Shaq. Let me go like this. Let me go this way. Let me go. Okay. I'll take that one. All right. I mean, that was nice. And with only one hook shot remaining to complete the challenge, the struggles continue for the rest of the first quarter. Okay. This is going to be it. This is going to be it. And... But then in the second quarter, this happened. All right, second quarter. Can we finally get a hook shot with Shaq right here? And yes, sir, challenge complete. With that challenge complete, Shaq is now 28 years old in his prime, and he's now a 99 overall. And for this challenge, we need to get a game-winning alley-oop dunk against the 2003 Detroit Pistons. And after keeping the game close all game long, tie game, 5.4 seconds remaining in the fourth quarter. This is my chance to get that game-winning alley-oop dunk. Let me get that alley-oop right here. Roll to the basket. Come on, Shaq, dunk it. And yes, with point two seconds remaining. What a pass from Kobe to Shaq. All we got to do now is just make one stop. And with point two seconds remaining, the Pistons had no chance. And after completing that challenge, we have a current Shaquille O'Neal at 51 years old, and he remains a 99 overall. And for this next challenge, Sharif O'Neal joins the Los Angeles Lakers, and we need to get three alley-oop dunks from son to father. And with the game set to Hall of Fame difficulty, this is going to be a challenge. But in my first possession, you wouldn't believe what what happened that's a really solid screen and can we get one? Oh, yo. oh what there's no way that went in we gotta see that one more time we went up for this alley-oop and we ended up hitting a three-point shot that is crazy and after knocking down that wild shot sharif o'neal and shaq had some great chemistry getting their first alley-oop dunk can we go in the one right here and yes sir that was just too easy we are now in the second quarter and let's see if we can get our second alley-oop right here from sharif to Shaq and oh no we got blocked but then after that failed attempt we got this one could this be it no and yes sir all we need is one more but after that we struggled to get our final alley-oop dunk in the second third but then in the fourth we are running out of time we need one more alley-oop dunk from son to father can we get it though right here come on Shaq come up there you go can we get it though right here and yes sir let's go challenge complete now we can go ahead and upgrade Shaq's age to 99 and with that challenge complete we now have this 99 year old Shaquille O'Neal and he's also a 999 overall and for my final challenge we're going up against the 90s all-stars and I need to get three contact dunks and also we're gonna keep the game difficulty on Hall of Fame all right let's see what this 999 overall Shaq can do and here we go first attempt Oh, yo, he can move. He's actually super quick. He's got Curry slide. Okay, okay. Solid screen right there from LeBron. Come around. Can we dunk this one on? Bro, we just got blocked by Hakeem. Holy smokes. Seven seconds, man. Let me get a contact dunk though right here. And Shaq. Hey, no, we mistimed it. And after mistiming my first contact dunk in my second attempt, I timed this one perfectly. Bro, this Shaq is quick. Let me get this contact dunk. Yes, sir. This 99-year-old Shaq was too much for the 90s All-Stars because right after that, I got my second contact dunk. Poster on Michael Jeffrey Jordan. Oh, my goodness. And to complete this challenge, all we need is one final poster dunk. And let's see if we can do it right here. Maybe we can get it on Hakeem, maybe. That'd be dope. Hold on a second. Let me get that screen AD. Ooh, step back. Come around. Yo, yo, Shaq is just too quick. Shaq is just too quick. And hey, that was a double contact dunk. And with that, we upgraded Shaq's age from 1 all the way to 99. If you want to see another cool video, click right here.